mga insomnias dyan. Welcome to my MV reaction video. And today I'm going to react to Dreamcatchers because music video. Supposed to be kagabi ako nag-record but unfortunately pagod ako sa biyahe, pagod ako sa work kagabi. And this is the reason I'm late for one day na mag-record. And I've seen a lot of comments from insomnias and non-insomnias alike regarding sa um, comeback stage ng Dreamcatcher for because doon sa M Countdown ng last Thursday. And sinasabi nila na parang sinaspoil yung um, buong song, yung buong choreography ng Because. And parang sinasabi nila na parang it's a mistake na gawin yung comeback stage ng Dreamcatcher a day before ng actual comeback of their music video. But there is a reason kung bakit nag-comeback stage the day before their actual comeback or the actual release of their music video, yung Dreamcatcher na nag-perform doon sa M Countdown. The reason is that they need to be eligible to be nominated doon sa mga music shows for next week. So dahil dito, in advance yung kanilang schedule ng kanilang comeback stage para it's a strategy. It's strategic for their agency na i-comeback yung Dreamcatcher a day before their actual comeback and the actual release of their music video. So I think, wala naman problema dun sa ginawang advance na scheduling ng kanilang comeback stage of Dreamcatcher. So I hope that the not insomnias or some toxic fans na sinasabi nila na they started to hate on Dreamcatcher dahil lang sa advance nilang mag comeback stage yung Dreamcatcher eh hindi pa nga nag-release yung music video and yung um, comeback showcase ng Dreamcatcher. Y'all start to hate on Dreamcatcher. No, it's not like that. It's just marketing strategy for Happy Face Entertainment to promote Dreamcatcher in advance. So I hope that everybody is enlightened with this one. Okay? Anyway, now that I'm here to react to Dreamcatchers because music video, I am so freaking excited. Kasi this is their second comeback for this year. And this is really interesting kasi even though na there are some concept photos of Dreamcatcher na summer vibes talaga, but still their concept is still the same. Ang spooky, horror, they're considered as horror queens of K-pop for a reason. And I know that their music video is going to be really really interesting, especially dun sa choreography of the song. Especially now that we saw yung um, performance teaser, yung choreography of Because, it looks really interesting to say the least. So I can't wait to react to their music video. So before we start, don't forget to click like, subscribe to my channel, hit the notification bell para maging updated kay sa mga videos ko each week, and share the video. Without further ado, let's get on to the MV reaction video of Dreamcatchers because music video. Was that she yon? The girl sa neck? The gay? This is like Hotel de Luna. Oh my 
God. Oh my gosh. Oh no no no, do not eat me half out. So Gavion is the main character here. Wow! <laughs> I think there are a lot of references dito sa music video na ito. I am getting sort of some Disney stories or yung mga Disney movies that were watched every day or in the weekends don sa TV. And I know that there are some who are familiar don sa mga references that was shown don sa music video. And I can already tell one, which is Hotel de Luna. But that being said, I know that this is all about summer. But then, summer is just getting creepy. Eh, hindi pa nga Halloween for crying out loud. And I know that Gahyon is the main character dito sa music video na ito. It's as if parang si Gahyon is the visitor don sa abandoned um, carnival, I think, or theme park to say the least. Parang ina-explore niya yung um, abandoned places doon sa um, lugar na iyon. And this is the reason kung bakit there are some things na creepy talaga. Just me, yo! <laughs> and parang at the end, hindi na-escape si Gahyon. And which is why, na-trap siya doon sa isang hotel, I think. And her time ran out. So I guess... Tama nga yung theory ko that it is regards to the references of the Disney stories or the Disney movies that we all love doon sa TV that we watch every weekend. So, I hope that you get my point here. But, that being said, I love that Gayon is appreciated here dito sa music video na ito because it's her time to shine. Finally, I know that Gahyon is one of the underrated members of Dreamcatcher and she freaking deserves the recognition here because she has been on sidelines palagi na she has less lines and pa-improve na pa-improve siya. And to see Gahyon being the main character dito sa Miss video makes me proud. I'm proud that the music video lets Gahyun to be the main character or the protagonist of this music video. So props, props to the director. Grabe ang galing ng editing, yung cinematography to make it look so spooky. Just me, you. I mean, Dreamcatcher never disappoint with the horror concepts na parang may trailer na may ang um, touch of trailer sa mga music videos nila and yung music nila um, may hint of yung isang classical piece which is for Elise by Beethoven tama ba ako? <laughs> hopefully tama ako dito kasi in, in incorporate dito sa song especially kay Gahyon doon sa part ni Gahyon and yung music box adds adds the chill doon sa song. I mean, sino ba naman yung hindi matatakot pag maririg mo yung music box na, na natugtog doon sa intro and the outro, yung ending ng song. I mean, having yung parang spooky vibes ng song 
adds to that even though it is still summer for crying out loud and that summer is almost over at least kahit pa paano this is a transition that halloween is near i know that halloween is a few months away but we all know that every happy um every happy season comes the spooky season so dream catcher is that ending point overall i love i really love yung costumes i really love yung set yung mv set talaga my god pati yung choreography doon sa intro i freaking love it <laughs> my inner gay in me is screaming just go i can't i can't i don't know how many takes na hindi um tumawa si suwa doon sa ginawa ni gahyon doon sa intro ng kanilang song but it cracked me up kasi i don't know how they kept their um their faces so um um poker face talaga doon sa choreo na yun it's amazing na hindi sila tumawa or anything just ko kung ako kay gahyon who stared at me for too long talagang tatawa ako at hindi ko talaga kaya because I am weak doon sa mga eye contacts. Anyway, the song is so good. I am so surprised na it's already 24 hours since yesterday. Ang daming views. Just go. I think the non-insomnias who contributed doon sa um, streaming ng music video na ito, who saw the comeback stage of Dreamcatcher, I na apply dito dahil they are really interested to see what Dreamcatcher is going to bring for this comeback. So, I hope that you keep on hyping Dreamcatcher for this comeback and claim their first win na ang tagal-tagal nilang maklaim. For crying out loud, please vote for Dreamcatcher. I'm begging y'all. Please, please, please let them have their first win. So, yung marketing strategy na ginawa ng Happy Face Entertainment is working. And I hope you'll keep on hyping and keeping the momentum of Dreamcatcher para mag nila yung first win. Okay? So, for the month of August, ang daming comeback sa August 2. So, I decided to react to Somi's Dum Dum music video. I think Dum Dum at yung title track ni Somi for her comeback since What You Waiting For. So that's going to be my first MV reaction video for the month of August. So stay tuned for that, okay? So that's it for this MV reaction video. Thank you so much and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!